Well, here we are at LAX, and we're getting ready for our big adventure. We're flying to Italy. We're going to hike in the Dolomites. But this is the first part, because I got a lot of film, so this is the first part. I checked my backpack. I got my neck pillow. You know, there's nobody here, but there's going to be lots. And I'm looking for leg room. And there it is. That's what I call leg room. Uncle didn't have much leg room either. He was on the other side of the plane against the bulkhead. We got a long flight, so let's settle in and get a drink. Once we arrived at Marco Polo Airport in Italy, we had to find the infamous Window 71. That was our ticket to get to the water taxi. This guy's telling us how to get there. It's not right by the airport. You walk down this thing and go through the park, turn left, go right, dock 15, boat 40. Okay, let's go. After about an eight minute walk down a long tube with lots of folks, we finally get to the water taxi. And there's the archetypal water taxi driver, Enrico. Enrico's going to take us to our hotel. We got in the water taxi, and guess what? It was totally empty. Not a soul in there. We were going to ride up. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. I got news for you. There are a lot of tourists in Venice. And these guys don't mess around when they race their water taxi from the airport to Venice. Finally we got there and we could do just a little sightseeing before we got to our hotel. As you can see the next day was rainy. It was a rainy day in Venice. So we found some vendors and we deployed the umbrellas. And you are viewing this from the umbrella cam. Du -du -du -du. We found this really cool exhibit of things that was made by Leonardo da Vinci, and they made scale models. Some were even working. But one of the coolest things is we were in this old church that they were using as their venue to show his works. It was really cool. <laughs> Back outside, the rain had backed off, and there was some cool graffiti, almost like Leonardo graffiti. Walking around really builds up an appetite, so we found a nice little place to eat on a plaza. And guess what we had? We had pizza. I went to talk to one of the locals, but he didn't want to talk. Okay. <laughs> So we kept on walking, and all of a sudden we came to a SIG alert. Yes, it's a gondola jam. This is more like uh, the 405 freeway as you're going past Century City. Look at those gondolas. Man, that is a mess of gondolas. <laughs> finally made it to San Marcos Plaza. This is the big kahuna. This is where it all happens. And there is one interested traveler. 
What do you think about that, mister? I think it's time for the Umbrella Camp. Yeah, this was really history in the making. And guess what? We were totally alone. Not, yes, you're there with 5,000 of your closest friends. It's what we call Tourship Jam. And once you get on a water taxi, you're on the Sardine Jam. Yes, this is the sardine boat, but it's the only way to get around in Venice. You kind of float up the canal, talk on your cell phone, and then you come to these cool little docks where everybody gets off. We took boat number one, which is kind of the milk run, and we found every, we stopped at every dock, and it was pretty cool. We finally made it to the Rialto Bridge. And guess what? So did everybody else. You know where all these people come from? Cruise ships. Venice has cornered the market on cruise ships. And everybody wants to go to the Rialto Bridge. But for a view like that, which is archetypal Venice, it's kind of worth it. After a day of wandering around, we came back at night. And we were in search of dinner which we found, and we had, you guessed it, spaghetti. After dinner, we got back on the sardine boat, and we decided to take our last trip down the canals of Venice at nighttime. And it is beautiful. <laughs> cool to cruise down the canals at night, see all the lights, see the advertisement for Michael Kors, kind of brings you back to reality. Somebody's got to pay for Venice. But our minds were thinking about tomorrow because we're heading to the Dolomites. <laughs> 